Hello everyone and welcome into more Seven Wonders Duel here on the Sorcerer Network. Jumping right in. Um, Alright, love that I get to choose first because um, Temple of Artemis I think is the best wonder. Hands down, ton of coins, extra turn, not that expensive. I think it's the best one. Um, it's, it's, it's what you should first pick every time. I am probably getting stuck with the pyramids here. Which I'm okay with. Yeah. All right, so he gets to choose there. Yeah, that's the one I would have chosen. And then I think that, excuse me. <coughs> um, I think, I, yeah, I like that choice there. All right. Um, I would love this papyrus. And then I will get my choice of either of these yellow cards. So I don't need to... Either one is fine. I don't really care. Um, but I'm happy to pick up the early papyrus. That's really going to... Really? Okay. I mean... Huh. I'm, I'm trying to understand that play. I mean, I guess it could be a, I'm saving up for something. Take the glass. I, hmm. Okay. Um, I will take this. Um, it, there is, as of note, law is here. Um, so, like, there's a world where we could get that. Um, all right, so he's just discarding a bunch of stuff. So he's just getting a bunch of coins. And I'm curious if it's just I'm getting a bunch of coins to get a bunch of coins or whether there's, like, a real purpose behind all these coins. I'm assuming he's going to take the clay? Yeah? I mean, I'll happily take the stone reserve then. Like, he's building up his wealth. No one has the discard thing. Okay. Um, I am feeling very good about discarding here. Okay. I'm cool with that as well. Um... I think that I want, I think I would honestly rather have this science building than another wood. You can go ahead and take it. I'm, I'm, okay, okay. Yeah, I'm happy to grab just the four coins, have some yellows. Not a whole lot of, like, resources we got, but I'm not upset at that. Like, that was a lot of cards discarded. So... I mean, he could be going just like, I'm going to win the wars, which, I mean, that's, I guess, an, a fine strategy. That's just a really risky one. Hmm. Okay, that makes sense. I think this is a nice play. I'm assuming he's going to grab the double clay. Yep, that's fine. I can blow that up. Um, I actually love this play right here because um, that will help me a lot down the road. I'm assuming he takes the blue card. Okay, no, he just discards that one. All right, well, I think because this building is free, I know it opens up the papyrus, but let's just... Let's just not have any shenanigans happen with, um, no shenanigans. Um, I think that it is the correct time to do this, because then we can grab this, and I believe that economy is exactly what we are looking for here. Um... I'm going to want to um, do Statue of Zeus here pretty soon as well in order to kind of... Okay, that's fine. I am happy to... 
I am happy to, you know what? I'm happy to construct, I'm happy to construct this. Nine victory points right there. Loving it. I'm 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 still just trying to wrap my uh, sorry for my silence. I'm I'm really trying to wrap my mind around the strategy that my opponent is attempting here. Okay. Yep, I I get it. Um it seems like just I'm going to win the wars seems to be the strategy. Um I'm going to take this building. Um I know again that opens up the wood. My hope is that he he denies me the progress token. No, he doesn't. Well, then I'm taking the progress token. Um, I think it's it's clearly this. Okay, that's fine. I'm gonna construct this wonder. And I'm going to get rid of um, the two clay. Because I don't have clay. So I don't want the price to be driven up. Um, and then I think I just get glass. I mean, I suppose he could bury this for the hanging gardens. So for all that discarding, my opponent really did make out pretty well in terms of resources. That's interesting. Okay. Um, the the only downside for my opponent here is that, like, discarding cards for them is just not great. Um, I mean, I'm happy to, I'm happy to do this. Um, and I'm happy to grab just a free three victory points and force my opponent to do something else. Curious what he does here. I'm assuming he wants to complete the wonder. Yeah. So he gets rid of the science card and gets a progress token. Okay. So we are very clearly being targeted in wars, so it's time to now just discard the war cards. <laughs> uh, we're just going to get rid of them. And hopefully we can grab some points in some other realms, yeah. So, like, um, I want to construct this one. Even though this one's free, I don't want to reveal these cards. I don't mind revealing this one. Um, though, I guess, in in hindsight, it's not going to matter. Oh, really? Um, I mean, yeah, I, I, I want that. I want all three of these cards, to be honest with you. Um... I don't think even with that strategy token, barring some really unlucky rolls, I don't think I have to worry about losing to a war. I think I do have to worry about losing to victory points, which is where that getting in this realm, like getting the 10, is going to be a problem. But I I don't think I need to worry about losing from my opponent getting too many war things. Gosh, that's unfortunate. I would like that card. This is, this, if my opponent was smart, he'd get rid of this card. Because cause I don't want my opponent to have this card, but I have to do something with this card. And in fact, I actually think it's worth spending the five coins to do this. So then we just kind of don't have to worry about this. Um, my opponent's not going to beat us in the wars, and that just kind of... My opponent might beat us in other things... Yeah, that's a good card for them. A very good card. So I'm happy to take the five victory points versus the... Now, this is... Yeah, I mean, it's a good, a good amount of coins for my opponent, but I, I don't know. I don't... As of this moment, I'm not... I don't really care. All right, I'd rather just have the coins. If you want to spend six coins to move three spots, good on you. Yeah, especially because you pay me a, a good amount of coins for that. 
Um, all right. Um, I don't really need the sciences. I guess the only argument is I don't want to give him five points, but eh, I think at this point it's six to one, half dozen to another. I mean, I suppose I could sit down and do all the math, but who wants to do that? That sounds like a lot of work. Happy to do that. Yeah, I, I'm. this is a close one. This is going to be a very, very close one. Um... I think that, okay, yeah, the progress tokens are helpful. Now the question is, did I, yeah, so, okay, um, really close game, but really what it came down to is I was comparable in the blues, um, had, you know, obviously more science, comparable in yellows, comparable in guilds, same in the wonders, but then these progress tokens and the coins kind of kind of pushed me over the edge here. That I had way more coins than my opponent. Interesting, interesting strategy by my opponent to really not go anything yellows and to just discard everything at the beginning. Just gain a bunch of coins and then just take like certain resources and then, like, try to go wars and, and blues. Like, it, 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 he played the wonders really well. That was an interesting strategy. Um, now, it ultimately did not end in the victory, so you can, um, you know, anytime that something doesn't end in a victory, uh, you can say interesting strategy, but I'm not sure how that, um, how that works. <laughs> but, uh, you know... Um, maybe, maybe, he's fun. maybe he's experimenting. All right, so my opponent is choosing a wonder first. I assume they take the Hanging Gardens. Yeah, so I take this, and then, I mean, I know the pyramids have been have done. Oh, that is, oh, oh that's good. Um, okay, great. Oh, oh, that's great. Ooh, wow, okay, so this is quite the opening row. Um, probably each of us will grab a reserve, and then each of us will grab one of these, depending on what gets revealed. Um, but yeah, I'm happy to take the reserves. Um, I'm assuming he takes the stone because it's free, so I'll, I'll grab the... Oh, no, he grabs that. I wonder if it was something that he, um, like he looked at his wonders, and maybe that's what he needed. I don't know. Whatever. Um... No law in the progress tokens. Um, I think just grabbing the straight victory points here is what I want to do. Um, okay. He probably takes that. Discards it. Interesting. Um, I'll, I'll play the sciences. I'll, I'll speculate. A little bit of a bummer that glass is there. But uh, um, the good news is we'll get a resource either way. Um, so I'm going to take the wood, assuming he takes the clay, and then we're going to discard for three coins here. I need some coins. A little bit of a bummer there. Um, okay, so he grabs the science card there. It's a little early to spend this, but, um, I'm... I want to grab this yellow card and the four coins. I think that just sets us up for a lot of stuff in the late game. And gets us on the right side here. While this uh, this uh, uh, clay reserve is tempting, um, I, I don't want, I, I want a, a, a one of these. Um, and I'm gonna feel pretty happy with that. And then I'm happy to grab the resource there. So we're pretty, pretty good on resources. Curious my opponent decides to like, Okay, yeah, my opponent just discards it. I think that was a smart play. I wouldn't have... All right, interesting. Curious what my opponent does here. Okay, grabs that. I think that's a smart play. Ooh, I'm happy to grab this. Um, I know that one of these is most likely to get blown up, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. Um, okay. Um, I know this gives up the symbol for my progress token, but um, I I would rather do that. And if this was any other card besides the one resource that I don't have, yeah, I would have. Um, hmm. 
you know what? I actually think I take this and I go here. And I go and grab this. And I grab economy. I love that play. Um, and then I don't mind playing this because I don't mind revealing these war cards. I'm, like, totally fine with that. Um, if my opponent wants to begin warring, good on them. I've got the Colossus that can help me. I've, you know, I can... See, this is where I think that I actually kind of want to put a little bit of pressure on my opponent that, hey, I'm not just going to totally ignore these wars. <laughs> like, we're not just, we're not doing that. Um, yep, that makes sense. My opponent has kind of run away with the yellows here. Um, I still think that's okay. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling good about where I'm at in terms of position. Um, okay, so yeah, my opponent responds by doing that, which is okay. Um, that's kind of what I hope for. That's why I like sometimes like playing a war card, even if I'm not like trying to get a war victory, because um, it forces my opponent to have to do something. That's fine. It is, I knew that was going to happen. Um, I think that I am okay. I'm going to use my my extra turn here, um, and I'm going to do this. Um, it does mean my opponent probably gets um, the wood. That's fine. And then I'm going to discard here. Um, if my opponent wants to grab two victory points here and another science card, so be it. I'd rather just have ten coins going into the next stage. Um, I am losing the war as of right now, so that will put me in a position where I will... Um, whatchamacallit? Um... Uh, choose who goes first. And I'm going to choose me. Um, I feel like I'm a little bit behind with how good of an economy my opponent has. Um, you know, obviously has a bunch of, of room for growth in these with his wonders. Um, but I also have a decent amount of victory points here that... Um, you know, I see the I see the three guilds. I'm gonna want to try to prevent the merchants guild if I can. Um, the other ones are are not as uh, I guess the wonders one is one that I'm gonna want. Okay, so he decides to go that. Oh, okay, interesting. Uh, very interesting. Um, okay. Um, I think that I'm gonna play this one. I'm very happy to have you spend eight coins to to go three shields if you want to spend most of your economy doing that. I'm 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 gonna feel pretty happy about that. So I'm assuming he's gonna start using his wonders here. Um I don't know if I would have used it there. Like what's what's the Okay, so he's he's doubling up. Okay, okay. That that makes that makes more sense. I'm honestly though. Happy to have my opponent do that. Yeah, see, I'm I'm ecstatic about that. Um, I think I construct the yellow one. It does give me coins, um, and it prevents my opponent from getting it. Yeah, that's fine. And then I do grab this one. This gives me a fair amount of coins, as well as three victory points, which isn't nothing. Um, again, I want to try to get, I, the good news is I should be able to get one of these guilds, um, even if I can't prevent my opponent from grabbing them, um, and I should be able to, um, okay, interesting. So, um, I think that I don't want my opponent to have this one. I don't necessarily mind if my... Because my opponent has a really nice money economy going. I really don't want my opponent to have the, the money one. Um, I think that we just discard this for six coins. Again, coins become extremely valuable now because of this guild. Um, that's totally fine. I believe that this is... Well, no, I want to do this one. Um... This is a little bit more coins for him, but um, I don't want him to have this guild. Um, so, and I don't care if he gets that. I'm willing to spend the five coins to get to get that. So, it's an additional two victory points there. 
Um, yeah, I'm 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 very curious how this one went. I think I have this because of the because of the two guilds. Oh yeah. Um, yeah the the guilds the guilds very much helped me out. <laughs> so yeah, the importance of these guild cards is cannot be understated. Um, much more a really good score there. Thirty seven on on blue cards is uh, pretty dang good. I, I kind of didn't realize how many of those I had. Um, so that was kind of really to be honest with you, all this other stuff, whatever. I mean, the guilds was great, but it was really the fact that I beat him on the blue cards. I had thirty seven. Holy cow! So, hey, thanks for joining us. Um, uh, if you are enjoying the content, hit that subscribe button, like, uh, comment, um, uh, tell your friends. I, don't, I almost said that. I don't know. Like, are you talking to your friends about the YouTube channels you're watching? Maybe you are. If you are, share. I, I just did a finger gun. That's what the snap was. So it, I know you can't see that. So, hey, thanks again. Thanks for joining me. Um, I need to end this video now. See you next time.